Hello and welcome to a Farming Simulator 2013 mod review with FS Panda Mushroom. You never guess we have a fast track JCB8310 for you today. There's the nice specimen in front of us. Let's have a look in the shop for you. Okay, in the pack comes a front weight, which is 15 k 1500 kg. A maintenance of zero uh, dollars a day. Interesting. And it will cost you $2,490 to buy. And then we have the Fast Track herself. The JCB Fast Track 8310. It's a six cylinder turbo engine. 306 horsepower, 2,100. Uh, RPM with a maintenance of $170 a day. It tells you a bit of more information there. It is a joint venture between J Horatio and Euro DZN. And this will cost you $112,300 to buy. Okay, let's go and have a look. And there it is. We will do the uh, normal walk around. But since our Euro DZN have had their fingers in the pie, so to speak, and helped out, J Horatio, um, I'm not expecting too many problems, if any problems at all. There you go, nice. I mean, it's a nice modelled um, machine. It looks the part. I mean, you know, it just is. Nice tyres. I mean, I could go around and say nice tyres, nice trim, you know, nice badging. But it is. You, you just have to go for it. Okay, let's just go inside because there is IC and I'll just start up. So, look at the front dash, there you get the lights when you preheat. Ooh, we've got little lights. We'll have a quick look around inside. Nice detailing. And some of you are saying, no, there's a whole gap in the window. No, there isn't. I'll show you in a minute. Right, there's the IC. You can change it to kilometres or miles per hour. So we'll sort that in a minute. And you've got the door. See if you now look, I'll do it on the back window. There's a metal reinforcing bars that go round for strength. So, no, they haven't missed a gap there. <laughs> okay, so don't panic, don't panic. Right, as we go forward you can see the pedals move and the um, joystick to the side. We'll change it. You can watch the clock, it goes up. That's miles per hour. If you like kilometers, I'm still on what am I? Let's change it over. Oh, sorry, you can see the ES limiter come up as well. That's kilometers, 
because I'm in the UK, I will use miles per hour. Okay, you can see the other thing that's uh, that's it for the IC. Oh no, sorry, I apologise. Uh -uh. You have an indoor light if you want. Okay, right. Let's just go on the external view. You can see, you can adjust the uh, hitch. Press K, goes up. M goes down. We can go through one, two, three. No indicators. Never mind. I don't use them anyway, but that's besides the point. Some people like indicators. Four, five. Six, seven, eight, nine. Got all sorts of lights everywhere. Okay, got a home key. Let's take her out for a buzz. Because it's supposed to be a fast track, it was designed for road work originally. Um, the newer versions, obviously, more horsepower, um, more field work, getting up to 40. Okay, nice. Alright, we'll just turn around. brakes and stuff. There we are. 40-41. What we have, we have a uh, trailer down here because obviously one of the things I want to fast track for is um, road work as well as Field work. So we'll hook it up. <laughs> no, we won't. We drive like the panda. Crap. There you go. It's acting like it's got a load, which is nice. Hey, it's a nice model. Um, it's been a long time coming, I suppose. A nice fast track. There you go, we're building up speed. It's not going enormously fast, but. Doing us proud. It's holding the road. Okay, we we'll just pull it into this field down here. Abandon it. All on the crops, look at that. Right. Here we have another one for you. Obviously it's a field tractor, it's 300 horse, so, you know, it should be able to press H. I've got 8 metre cultivator on here. It seems to be dragging it no problem, obviously from weight on there. I mean, it looks nice, it's acting nice, it's nice to drive. We just check, make sure when we get to the end it doesn't do any funky things on us. 
you know, like decide to clear off down the road or jump about or something like that. Yeah, nice. It works. You can hear the engine, it's got load on it. So, yeah, made a nice job. Right. Last little test for it. So we can see is I've got the class because you know this um, forage wagon I will say <laughs> I was going to say the picker upper whopper the snuffler as I call it um, is a heavy beast anybody that's used it knows it's a heavy beast I'll put it on speed one because as you can see speed one on this machine's 11 miles an hour which is not too bad um, we're full I've done that on purpose because you know this is a heavy beast so we'll just shake it about a bit see how she handles obviously you shouldn't do this but you know it's it's handling it quite well very good and the other thing about this anybody that's used this class um, reversing it with some tractors or most tractors kicks it up reversing it with this one nice nice very nice okay there we have it we have the fast track 8310 This is FS Panda Mushroom Thank you for watching Take care